you want to see things start happening in your life, you've got to look at the person who's stopping it from becoming reality. That's right. You, you are slowing it down. To be proactive and make things happen by making things happen, one must take initiative. Do you have what it takes to make the right left to you? Do you? If you have not already, please subscribe to my channel for videos to educate, entertain, and enlighten. The hardest thing to do is do in any field of interest. The act itself requires motivation with determination. The will of the want is not always enough. The same happens when that assumption, follow your passion, has a really slow start. Passion alone does not lead anywhere. I am passionate. But if I am stuck and laying in bed, it's pretty lazy fashion. But inside, I'm like, I want it! I want to get up and get some pizza! And, and, and of course you should follow your passion. You should be doing what you love. Why else are we alive but, you know, to enjoy the living aspect of uh, life? What I'm saying is beyond your passion. Have a plan. But a plan is as useful as passion if you do not take initiative. Every day is a new start. It's a new beginning, right? I mean, we hear it often in our lives. We read motivational posts. We watch videos of celebrities that give these speeches that make the hairs on our backs rise up. And maybe, maybe for a moment or two, inside we get pumped, excited, and we want to take a chance because Will Smith pulled us to do something. Jim Carrey's speech made us think, well, if he went from being homeless and writing a check for $20 million to himself and making it happen in five years. Well, if he could do it, I can. With all this pumping up and this motivation and this sharing and, hey, you could do it, buddy, pants, is that no matter what, the old saying of you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make it drink. The horse must be thirsty enough to take action and then it might drink, but how much? A plan, a set of goals, some tasks for the day. These are all things that can lead you to the next level. Hey, I have stuff, I have an idea, I can make, this is all great. If I do this, this will happen. These are wonderful, the dreams are nothing without the motivation to take action. You must create your initiative. So, without your thirst to pull you from the bed to get that pizza, you are just laying in bed hungry. I mean, if you had like a drone or something to fly the pizza to you, but then that's still taking an initiative. You're like, I'm gonna buy a drone, I'm gonna get batteries, I'm gonna lay in bed. This laziness is, is, the, is the mother of invention. Motivation comes from within everything. Everything you desire in life comes to you when you take initiative. I am in the mood for a slice of pizza, maybe a cup of ice cream. If I stand here, I'm thinking I want it all day, but until I take action, I cannot claim it. I must take initiative. And you know, you do it all the time. Take initiative. You do. But you take initiative for things you don't want. Going to a day job that you hate. You take initiative to get a job, go to the job, work at the job, as good or bad as you possibly can, just enough to keep the job. Because you want to have nice things. You want to have a house. You want to have a car. You want to have clothes. You want to go out. These are your wants. But these aren't the same wants as a desire of passion, a, a career maybe, or, or something you've always wanted in life. And you find yourself, why can I never get it? But you have all this initiative in you, being motivated through a thirst to want things. Now you just need to train your brain to change I want a nice car to I want my career. Take the initiative. Thank you for watching this video and supporting these traveling adventures of a resilient entertainer. Please like, comment, and share this video along with subscribing for future content. This is a very interactive series and I will happily respond to any productive questions within the comment section. And also for anyone who shares this video, please, at Thomas J. Blether, 
and I will in return share some of your stuff. Because that's what we do. We're a community of people who love and care and share. So as always, don't work too hard, but be productive. Peace and harmony, truth and action, my friends. Do you have what it takes to make a right left here? Uh, do you? Do you, punk? Do you? You want? I'm gonna go get some pizza. Oh dear.